Um. I don't know what to do with these guys. I think what I'm gonna do is that. I'm gonna do that. Take these guys and put them up here. There you go. And I'm just gonna tell them to do that. I don't know. I have no idea what I'm doing. Uh, this we need to shorten. To here. Right. Go. Oh, it's going. This is glorious. It's a glorious day for Germany. Wait, what? Overrun! And he has capitulated. First territory uh, conquered. Nice. Uh, there, there's no need for fancy maneuver. We'll just go in there and kill it. This is way more important. Uh, still six divisions down here. Is still everybody up here 12 except for whoever is here. That will go away in a second though. So these assign here. Except for you guys. You kill it. That should work. This also is working beautifully. Right, that's done. So now everybody's going up here. Yeah, that's done. <laughs> and they folded. All of them. Just like that. Didn't want to do that, but okay. Yeah, sure. Mm -hmm. Take it. Thank you. Well then. Kill it with fire! And uh, all of you down here. Yeah, exactly. Nice! Well, that means we can dispose with the formalities and careful planning and just say go. Awesome! There goes the next one. So nice getting peace conferences for each of these. We need to take care of that in a second. Alright, we should probably. Probably. We should take care of justifying against the next guy. Because it will take a while. So can't do these down here. That's out of the question. Can't do these up here. That leaves these over here. Henan and Hubei. Sure. 44, 112. Well, it's you then. Difficult ones get to be taken out first. 34 political power, 170 days. I can do that. How much would it be to do another one? If I do them one by one, it doesn't take that long. <laughs> That's more than twice the first war goal. Alright. We have 93,000 men, so we can actually churn out some more troops, and I'm gonna do that. Should be good. Don't like this. So that's 24, that's 8, and we're doing another 5, so yeah, we're getting there. Still not 24, but it's at least more than half. I guess that counts for something. Uh, these guys don't have anything to do right now. Well, they will in a second. They're gonna sit here and prepare for the almighty, glorious this. <laughs> yes, the almighty glorious this. That's exactly what they're gonna do. Okay, uh, you could actually start training a little bit. We're in the middle of a war, we're gonna start training. Who cares? Who even gives a crap, right? Exactly. So these guys, uh, please attach onto this uh, battle plan. We have dockyards. Sure. Have all the factories. That is so nice. Let's do all the fighters then, because why not? How many do we have? Still not the 500 we want, it seems. So, yeah, we want more. And also we'll drain manpower as soon as we deploy them. But it's okay. And then we should probably get all of these up to at least five. 
that will eat through resources, though. Steel we have! That, that's not an issue. So let's do this. This. This is steel and tungsten, which we don't have. Still gonna do this, because I can. We don't have the factories yet to do all of these, so <laughs> it doesn't even deduct those two tungsten that we don't have. It's good. You're gonna do that. That is some aluminium, which we do have. It's good. Um, we do want more of those, especially if we go tanks. Don't even have the manpower to use all the equipment, but yeah, let's do five. I feel like going 50 here, but now we're just gonna keep it at 25 for now. We don't have any oil for these guys. Minus 80%. Oil is becoming an issue. There's no oil factories here or anything like that. There is oil here though, and there is oil here. That's 14 oil. We need what? 16? 18? We're gonna get that. There's 6 over here. That's good. Who do you belong to? Tainan. Ah, Japanese sphere. Imperial Protectorate. So yeah, if we don't want to go to war with Japan, that's not a thing. Can't go to war with these guys, otherwise we're at war with the whole faction. So we're gonna swoop through the middle and just grab whatever we can. It's not much though. There's 11, but then again, that's the Mark Click. I guess that's our first big target. Right, let's finish this war. Oh, look, we're getting attacked. Oh, look at that. Why is that so bad? I don't even know, because it's one division attacked by all sides? Well, reinforcements are coming, right? Yes. Don't even worry about it. This is something that needs to get done. You come over here. And just go. We are going to hold that. Yes. As soon as the front on here gets reinforced, it's over. Oh, can we get a cutoff here? Can we actually make this happen? Go here. And just annihilate that. Seems like we can. Also, these guys are no longer needed here. Because they were not ever gonna reconquer that city. Yep, got a cut off. Nice. So now these guys are going to move here. No. This is the route you go. Or, or, these guys are going to go here. I just need to get that port before they file out. And have it. It's not what I wanted, but it's good. Frontline still exists, that's very nice. Currently struggling a little bit with just five divisions against an entire country. But we're gonna get reinforced here real real soon and then that issue is going to go away. There you go. Are you done yet? <laughs> Man, this war is something else. Okay, before this is all over... Ah, uh, well, since the countries capitulated separately, uh, because the, the, the main, the mother country capitulated first, um, we don't get to see all the stuff anymore. Dang it. We only lost 6,000 men. We had like 30,000 earlier, so I... I just, eh. Don't know. 48,000 in the last 12 months. Yeah, see, we've been fighting for... 8 months. As you can see by the number not changing anymore. 48,700... 48,701, huh? 710, that's what I wanted to say. Great. <laughs> they lost 130,000 equipment. We lost... 6. It's okay, it's okay. 
They have a better win ratio. Well, well, then again, it's only three of them. If they attack, they probably attack where all of these are. So, yeah. Yeah, okay. It's okay. Okay, we're doing good. 48,000. Tolerable. Currently losing them. Really fast, for some reason. Who are you? What do you want? Are they doing shore bombardment here? Is that why we're losing people? <laughs> the moment they arrive down here to assist, this war will be over. Told you. And there we have it. Our first major conquerage. That's a word now. We started over here, not bigger as that star, and now we have the East Coast. Right? So, East Coast China, ours. Can't go north, can't go southwest, but we can go west. And we're gonna do that. Already planning on that, Wardle. I hate it how this always pops up after a victory conference. Everything resets. Right. Still trying to get some points to get all of this knocked out, really. Why Emperor Taisho? Pity I didn't know you. <laughs> well, getting there <laughs> soon ish. Uh, I do want to continue doing that, but it doesn't decrease, it seems, right? It's permanent. It does decrease. If I were to go for Britain now, I think this would decrease. Because these two don't like each other. So, hmm. We'll see. Oh, that's good. Agriculture, sure. Right. What are we going to go for next? Do we actually need to defend our territory with forts anytime soon? No, but we do need construction because we now own more territory. And we need to do stuff with it. Don't need that, don't need that, don't need that. Still don't care. And there's still... well, yeah, it is available, but that's all that is available. There's nothing else here. We're back to our um, former stability and war support. That's good. We're ready to go on. And we can't be attacked from anywhere, really. If we get attacked now, the only people that could attack us are these two. Don't care. Or, if it's like this or these two, it will be the whole clique, right? That's going to be an issue, then. The question is, can we take them out now? Because this is the only front I really need to hold to the north, right? <laughs> well, that would stop all of these people coming into my territory. I could use the Red Army, go through here really quickly, and use the Blue Army to defend up here. And once I'm done down here, I'm, take the red, I'm gonna take the Red Army up here and just march north. Until we get to this point, it's a relatively short front line, so we should have the advantage. There's no forts. It's hills. It's not too bad. It's four provinces, which means you would have two divisions in each province. That is not enough. We do need the extra manpower. As soon as we have that, that is a viable option. Now, if we go through this country, we would open up this whole front here. Don't actually want that. Now, how are the other troops down here? That's 43. That's peanuts. That's 39. It's also peanuts. This is all peanuts, as we've just seen. It is peanuts. Unless um, they have some weird conception of how to build their troops. But this is nine factories. They can not really do that much with nine factories, right? They have 14. That's better. 15, that could be some artillery in there. 9, that's nothing. 10, eh. Uh, 14, eh. Uh, 7, nah. Mongolia, you suck big time. Th that's nothing. Wait, right, so that's 11, that's 17, that's 33, that's 9. There's where the strength lies. Otherwise, if, if all of these were the same, I think if they were all like Mongolia, we would have run through here with our four divisions or eight divisions or whatever that is, um, before we conquer these down here. Mm. Dang it, can I? I know I spent political power on that one. 
crap. Crap, console. 66%, yes, console. I'm not gonna do it. I have another plan, which is pressing all the wrong buttons, and then re deciding that that was a good idea. I'm gonna go here. This is a pretty long front. It's not gonna be fun. Should probably put up some forts if we can. Probably can't. Anyway, I'm gonna go through here. I'm gonna start up here. I'm gonna take these guys and put them up here. As long as this front is that small. Already gonna give you the order to go here. Can't go any further because, you know, different country. There. Yeah. Alright. Deployment. This is not good, but we're gonna do it. Okay, you're gonna go. All of you on this. 11,000 men. We definitely need more men. Now more than ever. So everybody on this. That worked. So, one, two, three, four provinces. We now have, well, almost 15. If we had 16, that would be four divisions per province. That should hold it. This is the only one that can be attacked from three provinces. No, it's not true. This one can also be attacked from three provinces. Yikes. This one only two. This one only two. So these are the, the choke points. Now, how about we do this? I think that's a valuable option, right? Start with that, then that. Exactly. The choke points that can be attacked uh, in force, and then the other two. And we just hold that for now. Uh, we also want an airport right here. It's probably going to be here or so. So we can put our planes there. We do have one over here. That's not bad, but I'd really like to have that one at the front. And uh, we need to do all of this. Okay, that's going to be fun. Sure. I think we already figured out that we don't get a bonus on resources when we upgrade, right? Yeah, we don't. So that's pretty useless, other than for the actual construction speed that we get afterwards. So I think what we're gonna do is take some of this territory here. That was already pretty good. This one too, please. And get some Construzione Factories. We do have some now. Uh, we want more. Currently we can do two. Yeah, we have 33. Three go for consumer goods, two for trader goods. So we will technically almost have two full rows. It does show as having two full rows, which is weird. Because that math doesn't compute. That's, that's 35. We have one from trade, so that's 33. One. It's weird, game! Don't do this to me, you're messing with my math. Look at that, that's already... That's already nine, that's good, but you're all... You're all four. Crap. Uh, this will take a while to do, and all of these will take a while to do. Oh, that is actually not bad, and that is also not bad. Doesn't matter now, anymore. It's okay. So I'm gonna do that. And then we're gonna do the rest and just fill it up with military factories, because that's what we're going to do. So close to home, we have civilian factories so we can construct and repair, and further away we put our military factories. It's a thing. So is there anything here we could use? This is all just research time, which would be quite nice. Um, carbine, soft attack, reliability, production cost. Only works for the equipment researched while these are hired. Now, let's have a look at that. What's gonna finish soonest you? We do want to go here, right? That's 175 days away and that's another 178. That's Combat Equipment 3. That's not 
carbine. Carbine is over here. So combat equipment. Is there anything? Where was I? Here. Is there anything for combat equipment? It's probably just you. There. Start attack plus 10, defense plus 10, production cost plus 10. I like those stats better. Don't mind the extra production cost if I get 10%. That's actually quite good. Five percent soft attack on top of the mortars that are already pretty OP, and production cost reduction. It's good. Don't we have those already finished? 